Hello. My name is Deidre and I love my pamper chef tools. <laughs> um, today I need to do a lot of prepping. I'm going to be making some Cajun shrimp etouffee. So um, I am just going to show you a couple of my tools. First of all, I have my coated Santoku knife. I love this thing. It has stayed sharp for, I don't even know how long I've had this, but I love the way it fits my hand. I love how sharp it is to cut. And if you don't have it, you need it. Um, this knife is one of the best I have ever had. This is our rapid prep mandolin. On the back, you see there are two dials. One is for how thick you want something cut and sliced. The other is so that you can julienne. Um, you can um, do just your round circles like for um, um, potatoes. Um, you can french fry cut, um, make your um, potato gratins. You can do sweet potatoes in this. I'm gonna be showing you onions, bell peppers, celery stalks. And so all you have to do is put it together, put the on slice it up um, in the chute here. And because I'm wanting these pretty thin and you can see that it's pretty thin it had called for minced onion and so I thought yeah easier and faster. So it calls for um, one and a fourth cup of this mint So, uh, let's see. You can store things in. They do have lids. They have measure lines on the side. So you've got this. This is a two cup. This is a one cup. So since I need um, one and a fourth cup, I'm just going to use my hands because they are clean. And it's just going to be my husband and I, but I'm going to see how many I have already. Looks like I'm going to have plenty. It's just that little bit. So, yep. Okay, so that is right there at the one and a fourth cup. So, I've got that ready to go. Now, I'm not going to clean this out because I already needed, um, already needed some, already needed onion in my recipe. So, I've got that. So, now, I am going to do some bell peppers. It still needed to be minced, so I've cut up my bell pepper. Didn't think you needed to watch me cut up my pepper, so I'm gonna put this in here. And go ahead and slice it up. And there it goes. And this is gonna be my first time to make etouffee, so I sure hope my husband likes it. Uh, and I will have a picture for later after we get that in. And I need some celery. Let's see on the green peppers, yeah, just need a few of those. And how many celery stalks? Three fourths cup of celery stalk. So now, we also have these uh, prep and store bowls. These are wonderful when you're wanting to prepare something ahead of time. 
They have the drain that you can put in the bottom, like if you want to keep wet stuff from getting all over. You can also, um, let's see, which, where's my other one? You can also put dividers in these. So when you're fixing something and you want to put two fruits or two vegetables in here, you just, of course, I would be having problems right now. You just put your little divider in place and then you can put like your, I'm going to put bell peppers on one side and then I'll put my celery in the other. So I've got that, even though it doesn't really matter because everything's going to go together, but there I have my bell peppers in this one side. And then I'm going to go ahead and do my celery, and I will put in the other side. So, let's see how the celery does. I've not ever tried celery in this, but here we go. Let's see how it does. And so far, I'm not even getting it going. There. I need to get it a little thicker. Yeah, there we go. to do the roux and then add all this to it while I'm cooking and then add the oh didn't do the andouille sausage yet let's do it real quick and then I will leave you to it so I've got those in the container I'll put my onions and the andouille in it and then we'll be done let's get the andouille sausage out Cajun style and doing snuck sausage. So here it is. I'm going to go ahead and cut this into smaller pieces to go in and just kind of show you real quick how that uh, let's do this thicker pieces because we want chunks in our so I'm going to turn the top one down to rounds, and then I'll show you the difference. See that? So you can change this all you want and have exactly what you want in your, in your meals. Look at that. Isn't that cool? So get one of the, any of these. You need your prep bowls. You need a rapid prep mandolin to make your prep time so much faster. So if I can help you, let me know. Thanks.